Hey everyone, this is Mike from TechHog.com again, and uh, today we're going to be uh, talking to you about a new app that just came out, and it's called Till, or T-I-L, for Today I Learned. It's from the Handmark company, and uh, so I'm going to go right on in here. You'll see the app up here at the top, and basically what this app is, is um, a way to read uh, Reddit.com's Today I Learned features, um, and what it does is it pulls the, the, the feed, more or less, off of... Uh, the website and puts them into a really easy to use list. Um, you'll notice that they kind of appear almost like text message, uh, text message style um, updates. And um, you have three bars at the top. You'll have the hot, new, and top. Um, obviously, the hot one is going to be whatever your hot stories or hot submitted um, updates will be. Then you're also going to have uh, the new, which will be the newest, obviously, and then the top, which is your overall top picks uh, what has been submitted. Um, the bottom, you know, there's kind of the little, the little dotted lines at the bottom here. That functions almost like it does on the HTC Sense um, on the Android drop-down bar. Um, if you pull this up, you'll notice that it has go to connect settings. Um, it says connect app to remove ads for 30 days. Um, in order to achieve this, if you go here, you can see how it says reddit.com and Facebook. And if you connect uh, both of these accounts, it'll eliminate the use of the um, the ad features that usually come across the top. <clears throat> the third one is this this ad here, where basically all you got to do is just share the app on Facebook. So basically, what it is is it's a little plug for them. Um, you click it, it tells your friends that you're using it, and they should check it out as well. Um, so it gives you 30 free days of of no ads. And um, basically, when you have the Facebook feature um, turned on, so let's say that you find uh, a story that you might find humorous, you might find intriguing, or you might find that you learned something. Um, it's very easy to come in and pick a story and then just tap on it and then hit share on Facebook. And when you do, it gives you a breakdown of what's going to show up. Um, today I learned, or you can actually come in and actually edit. So it says today I learned, and then begin to type, and it actually gives the link to the proof if there is any, um, and just hit share and you go. Um, you'll notice that the little the story here at the bottom, if the story, if I'll go back here one, if it has a picture to the left of it, it means there's like photographic proof or a website um, that would, you know, lead to have some credit. Um, so, for instance, like this one here, um, we pick this, and uh, again, it's on the Wikipedia page, and it kind of shows you where they pulled their proof from. Not all the stories are going to be true. Um, you might find some humorous ones, you might find some offensive ones. Um, but overall, it's it's a pretty good time sink to to have some fun with it if you're bored and sitting around waiting somewhere in a waiting room and you just want to find some you know, some humorous things. Um, in order to change the topics, it's really easy. All you do is just hold on to a button or the screen and just swipe it across, and you'll notice the top button there changes to new, which is highlighted. And again, you can kind of scroll through down here. Um, if you're not sure if you have the newest ones, you can actually hit the refresh button, which is at the top. And you'll see it's pretty quick, and then boom. Now, obviously, I just did this, so um, pretty much everything is is current and up to date. And you do, it's pretty interesting stuff. I mean, here you go. Is uh, Today I learned Trent Reznor did the music and sound design for the original Quake game. Um, for you gamers out there, if you find that humorous, or I'm not humorous, but if you find it interesting and uh, you want to share it with your friends, again, just hit the button, share on Facebook, boom, share. Um, I'll do this one here. And that's it. That's as fast as it is. I mean, it's it's quick. Um, below, here's your your proof again if you want someone to kind of see what it is, the Wikipedia. Um, simple back button, and then your top stories. Um, this little button here, it brings you to your connect settings, and uh, that's pretty much it. Um, it's a really simple, easy-to-use app. Like I said, it's from the Handmark company. Um, it's in the Android market, and it's for free. So um, nothing to lose, and it's a great little time sink to kind of have some fun with, and uh, just recommend you guys try it out. Hope you enjoy it.